Raccoons are exceptional climbers. In fact, it's virtually impossible to keep raccoons from getting on your roof. If they want to get on your roof, they will. And there's only two reasons why raccoons are on your roof. One is they are trying to get into your attic or your chimney, or they already are in your attic or chimney. So it is very, very difficult to keep them off your roof. They can climb downspouts, they can climb brick, they can climb stucco, uh, you name it. If they want to get on a roof, as I said, they can. Of course, it doesn't help that if you have you know, trees overhanging your, your, uh, your roof, they can climb those trees and, and get on the branches and get onto your roof that way. You don't want to be cutting down trees because they will find another way on your roof, but don't make it easy for them. If you do have branches overhanging your roof, get up or, or hire a tree company to come up and, and trim your tree. Same thing with fences or pergolas or anything that's close to your home that one animal, such as a raccoon, can get on, climb up and get onto the roof that way. You know, it's kind of hard to keep those animals off that uh, structure, which in turn can get onto your roof. So that's why it's always, always best to animal proof your structure. Seal it up so you don't have to worry. And remember, there's 30 to 50 in a square kilometer and we're never getting rid of them. They're here to stay. So animal proof your structure. Be diligent as a homeowner, walk around your home, make certain that you don't see any of this evidence of paw prints, dirt, smears, grease, fur, that type of thing. And if you do, give us a call here at Skedaddle, because once again, two reasons animals are on your roof. One is they're trying to get into your roof or chimney, or two is that they're already in there. So be diligent, uh, maintain your property, uh, and let's reduce human and wildlife conflicts.